As everybody know, this is Coco, and he's my best friend and uh, my favorite pet. Uh, I've had him for about five years now, and he's been really good to me. Right, Coco? Hey, buddy. Okay, so today I'm going to demonstrate to you how I change uh, bedding in his cage because it's kind of uh, nasty right now. It's It has a lot of poop in it so we're gonna go ahead and uh, change it and uh, clean up his cage and put the new bed in, um, in his cage so it's gonna be all fresh and nice for my Coco right his house is gonna be clean today all right so I'm gonna remove everything that he has the water bottle right here so we're gonna put this aside for now I'm gonna remove his hay I'm gonna open the cage up. All right, and Coco's out. I'm gonna set the cage right here in the in the middle of the room right now, and try to get the Coco to go inside the cage because I'm gonna step outside the night, and he likes to bite stuff and chew on everything. So that's why I don't want to leave him ba uh, back here alone because he can chew on wires and stuff like that. All right, Coco. Coco. Ooh. Coco's excited to be out, right? All right, Coco. All right. And go back inside. All right. Let's get, let's get all your toys out and your food plate. All right. Let's take all this <laughs> gross stuff outside. All right, so his cage is all cleaned up. I throw, I have thrown everything away. I hosed uh, everything down and I uh, wiped it off with the paper towel. And uh, for his uh, for his bedding, I'm I'm always using a paper, uh, natural uh, paper bedding, and it's called uh, Care Fresh. And I, it's uh, a 25.7 liter and it expands up to uh, 60 liters and this is like the best deal I buy from uh, Amazon uh, because I just love Amazon and uh, how easy it's to shop and you know how you get your uh, deliveries uh, really fast to your house so I'm gonna put this inside his his cage guys don't I would not recommend uh, using like uh, wood shavings and stuff because uh, it can uh, the, 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 your pad can uh, like start sniffing, you know, and it can uh, be like allergic to him. Uh, and this this stuff, the paper bedding has less dust content, and also it expands uh, quite a bit. So you don't need to put too much inside because it will absorb all uh, all of his, uh, you know. Uh, uh, poop and uh, pee and we'll expand in size yeah so now it's all fresh and all changed up and let's put Coco bed back inside his cage ah. hey Coco yeah you know you like that right yeah Coco oh, you, 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 you. alright Lock it on both sides. Let's put the water bottle back inside. All right, so that's done. Oh, Coco, I forgot about your toys. There you go. These are his favorite chewing toys. You know, to make sure that his teeth are, you know, not growing too long because they constantly grow and they need to chew something. Oh, and here's your tray of hay. All right, Coco. You're looking good now and fresh. 
So it took me uh, about, you know, three to four minutes to change everything up and uh, uh, have Coco back inside his cage. So that's how you change uh, batting uh, for your pad. In my case, it's Coco, a bunny, right? White bunny. Yeah. So if you like this video, give me, uh, give me a thumbs up, guys. And uh, I'm also going to put the link below uh, for that paper bedding that I use. So if you have a bunny or you have a, a, uh, another small animal as a pet, go ahead and use it. It's, uh, it's good for them. So thanks for watching and uh, I'll see you in the next video.